morning, guys. What's up? Hey, hello, everyone. We are back here wearing pants for this video, and today we are going to be showing you how to balance these assortment of balls on this Lauren stick. Yeah, so like our last challenge video, we made those cool blocks. Uh, we actually made this uh, nice uh, ball holder uh, also, so we'll see how this goes. Once again, immunity is back up for grabs. For today's challenge, you're gonna stand on a narrow beam while balancing a ball on a platform. At regular intervals, your feet will move down to a more narrow beam. Your hand will move further down the pole, making it more difficult to balance. If at any point you fall off the beam or you drop your ball, you're out of the challenge. Wait, you know, this is my non-dominant hand. <laughs> what are you <laughs> doing? Rachel. <laughs> no. <laughs> Why don't you pretend like you're on a balance beam? Okay. Oh, that's how you did so long, you dummy. <laughs> oh, I could never do the circus. <laughs> All right, everybody in their first position, place your balls on your platform. Get them steady. You can keep holding on until I tell you to release. Here we go. Three, two, one, release. This challenge is on. Never mind. I bet this is what Rachel's doing. All I'm this gonna morning. practice in my free time holding balls on sticks, guys. Oh my god, put it on her resumes. I can bounce. Professional can... ball stick holder. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like part of this challenge has to do with like if your ball starts resting <laughs> at a certain at a certain angle, then it's easier. Can we just call this episode balls? Let's um let's calculate the velocity of these balls. <laughs> and the angle at which they start at. Everybody is safe. Move down to the next level. Move your hand down one level on the pole. And let's put your balls back up. All right, here we go. I'm gonna count you in. Imagine you're uh, oh, on a balance beam. Oh. Ooh, see, look how stable I am on one leg, on this leg. Is this like, is it that easy for them on Survivor? Like, do you think this is the kind of ball they have? I don't know. This is actually pretty easy, like, it's not moving. A lot. Well, their balance beam is also smaller than their foot, right? What? <laughs> so it's like, <laughs> bye. Uh, AP physics? We talked about moment of inertia in our regular physics class. No, we're GT, Alyssa. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Oh, shit, you made me laugh. Whoa. That's the distractions Jeff would do. Jeff totally would. We do, like, left hand. How are you so much better than me? Wow, guys. Maybe Rachel should be the neurosurgeon, not you. Yeah, maybe. With the steady hands. Asha with a nice recovery. There you go. Get it back together and you're good. Here comes a little wind again. Spencer with a nice recovery, but he can't do it. Spencer's out. Tasha wins individual immunity, guaranteed a spot in the final seven. Yes, so that was us doing this survivor challenge. Not really much strategy, I guess it's more practice. So if you guys have any more survivor related videos, comment down below. We will film them in the summertime. Yay! Yay! This challenge is so confusing, like I don't even know. Okay. So Wait, do we have identical? Yeah, we have identical.